Hey, how's it going guys? In this video, I'm gonna show you the quickest way to see the trend in a stock. And this is by using the GMMA or Guppy Multiple Moving Average Chart. This technique was invented by Daryl Guppy and it's both easy to use and effective. So thanks, Daryl. The chart is composed of two different sets of exponential moving averages. These are short time frame and longer time frame. I use a 2, 3, 5, 8, and 15 for shorter time frame, and those are in red. And I also use a 30, 35, 40, 50 period moving averages for a longer time frame in blue. Real quick, if you haven't watched my first video, here's how you set up a moving average. So what you do is right click right here, add plot here, and we're going to type in exponential moving average. Then it automatically sets up a 50 day. So we're going to edit this and set whatever period we want. Let's just have this be at 10. And here we'll make this, since it's a shorter time frame, it will be in red. And there you go. There's that additional exponential moving average. By using these averages, trends are immediately apparent by the overall pattern in color. When it's in a red, white, blue pattern, it's in a strong uptrend. When it's in a blue, white, red pattern, it's in a downtrend. It's also important to point out that the bigger the spacing in between the two different sets, the stronger the overall trend. It's also helpful to look at different overall time periods when using the GMMA chart. I personally have a TC2000 chart for both a daily and weekly guppy chart, and this way I can quickly switch back and forth between them. Strong growth stocks with good fundamentals, such as the stock list that I post on Twitter, hint, hint, can make amazing gains without ever falling out of a red, white, blue weekly pattern. For instance, TTT has advanced nearly 400% since this time last year, and since the start of that trend, the shorter time frame averages have never crossed over the longer ones. So before I make any trade, I always check the weekly and daily guppy charts, and if they are both in a red, white, blue pattern, it is a strong indication that I should own that stock. I've also made a TC2000 indicator to identify when the red averages are really moving up rapidly. A link to that PCF code is in the description. This indicator is my purple dot indicator, and it's a great way to help determine entry points in a stock. For instance, a good entry point would be when a growth stock is in a weekly red, white, blue pattern, and then the daily chart first shows a purple dot indicator. So overall, the GMMA chart is quick and easy to use, and it's a very effective way to analyze trends. And this isn't just restricted to individual stocks. It's also just one more way to look at how the indexes are doing. That's it for the video, guys. I hope you learned something. Please leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. And make sure to subscribe if you aren't already. See you guys in future videos.